Cyprinus addiction with a super spawn 24 and a half pound common car. Look at that. Look at that belly. This is crazy. Full of eggs, baby, full of eggs. Look at Oh, good morning <clears throat> well we all packed up right there we are back again on the road to get some fish uh, I'm going back to <clears throat> the pond because uh, this past weekend uh, Easter weekend yeah something really special happened in this pond and uh, I think it'd be appropriate for me to be in that special place uh, to talk about what happened, maybe reel some fish today, but also show you uh, some pictures and some history that happened this past weekend though. Uh, and I think we just got to head that way. So I see you in a little bit. I'll be fishing with Patrick today, my friend. So hopefully he gets some fish too and we just have a nice video and uh, hope you enjoy this. So stay tuned, I'll see you a little bit. So you play with that drag, that way it doesn't... It's not too tight or whatever, you know what I'm saying? Alrighty, we got Patrick with his personal best. Little shy on the 26 pound, look at that big fish. Awesome, awesome, awesome looking fish. How you feel about that, bro? Great. <laughs> Good fish. Good That's what we came over here for. That right there. That's exactly what we came for. All right, let's let it go. We got, a, got some worms over here. We're going to take care of that before we let it go. Yeah, man. So, here's my buddy, uh, Patrick. Already broke his PV 26 pound. And the reason why we are here, because I want to talk to you about this card that I caught. By the way, I didn't tell you about that. You know that fat card, fat card that I sent you? Yeah. So, that card was caught by two other guys. And I got pictures on it. I'm going to show you the first one by Jesse Chavez, a good angler, local angler. He caught that fish back in 2017. So how about that? And that time, she, he said that that fish, that, that, that fish looked kind of sick, had some wounds, probably for the spawn. Then, talking in the internet with the other guys, find out that another friend, Chris Vine, caught this same fish 2019 check out the picture back, right? yeah they get to go back you know people talking about it. anyway so after Chris find uh, another local angler caught the fish in 2019 right now just last week in Easter week at 2020 uh, 2021 I ran to that fish one more time. Incredible. This fish was caught in a double wafter rig. Check out the picture too. That was pretty insane. So, after all that talk and those pictures, brought me to the main subject of this video, today's video. <clears throat> catch and release 
thankfully for many species of fish in these days, including bass, crappies, catfish, gars, drums, you know, any local species, any native species, including also the naturalized fish, which is the common carp. Also, buffaloes are in the line of fishing. The, the catch and release culture on the fishing community has been exploded and this is why the reason why us carp anglers take care of this fish so much. This trophy sized fish that you know she's in here, she was caught during the spawn, all those three times including my time. And it's important because if you eliminate every every trophy sized fish those genes will eventually disappear and the population of big nice sized fish will eventually diminish and you will only have a bunch of little fish okay so uh, in honor of this wonderful fish this big uh, common card that I named Doña Carpa which is Doña is a it's a nickname for really old people you know <laughs> for old people old women for example you know she's a big old fish it's still bigger yeah. Oh yeah. Definitely. Oh yeah. Let's see ya. Fathead. Nice. Oh yeah. Oh, that's a big one. In the net. Nice. Take a picture and post it, it on Facebook. Is wow. it still alive? Yeah. It's alive. Yeah. Yep. 23 pounds. What? 23 pounds. Wow. <laughs> Lucy sat there behind the bed. So oh, yeah. Take a picture. Yeah. There you go. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That's all you get when you fish in the, in the pond. All right. Oh, goodness. Wow. Nice, man. 23 pounds. Oh, yeah. Too. I hope they do. Ready? All right, another, another big mama, full of eggs. There she goes. <laughs> so how about that? You know, I came to this pond to tribute this awesome fish. This and and honor the catch and release anglers here locally in my area and are all around the world. Doesn't matter what sport fish you target, you conserve those big genes. And today, I just caught another fat fish, another fat female that I gladly release, just like Patrick releases new PV 26 pound back in this water, back to live, back to uh, make more babies and we, can, we get the chance to catch them keep fishing for this fish. Well, all right, man. Uh, another video, another adventure. And what an awesome day to tribute this awesome big carp uh, that I caught last week. You know, Patrick beat up his personal best 
Patrick, welcome to the club, the 20 club, 26 pound. I got a nice, real like looking like the other one, uh, Doña Carpa. Uh, 23 pounds, really spawn. Uh, gotta keep hitting this spot until the spawn is over. This morning, where we got, we saw a lot of uh, commotion, so there's already some cars already spawning. So we were able to land uh, three actually, two uh, was the significant one. But anyway, uh, if you watch this video, man, get into catch and release, specific those big fish, those five pound, 10 pound bass, those uh, 20 pound, 15 pound channel catfish. Know what's a trophy size, and if you get the chance to reel one of those big ones, doesn't matter what species it is, Put it back in the water we need those eggs we need those jeans we need um, the sport to keep growing and a catch and release mentality so anyway thanks for watching cyprinos addiction stay tuned for the next adventure uh we're hitting the, the last the last weeks of spring going back to summer so the dog days of hot weather but anyway uh, we will try to do the best we can to the fall all right so thanks for watching cyprinos addiction and i'll see you next time is ready to go. Look at that. One more look.